Yo, what is good, my anime people? Let's talk about this episode, man. I am late. I apologize. I apologize. But holy crap. Stop sleeping on this spinoff of Inuyasha. Because it's coming to a close, supposedly. The last episode is coming out next week. And it's kind of mind-blowing to think that a show like this that probably could have gone on for a long time and uh, done a lot of fluff and buff of more of the characters that we were seeing them fighting and making them stronger. It feels as if the show never really had the idea of being like Inuyasha. Shocking, right? It's it's a thing that takes place in the world and it's not trying to be like Inuyasha. What? They actually seemingly want to come to a, a conclusion and that's understandable just because there's things that this show was trying to do to make it really cool and i think the asteroid is the big telling point of why things are kind of hard is because there was there's really only two setup points throughout this whole entire season of the asteroid one telling us about it and how the demon dog the great demon dog and the main bad guy take it out And then now, all of a sudden, he exists on both planes. He exists in the human world and in this, in the demon realm, or just the different time periods. And he's like, oh, well, I guess I can see him on both sides, meaning I should pay more attention to this, right? Like, pretty much just saying that he's known this time was going to come, but sooner or later, it was going to be something he cannot stop. And the other facet about this is we really get to see what Lord Shishomaru is kind of up to not only is Zero super important to him he's super important to the girl's mother which unfortunately just by killing Zero aka the the wife or the mom of Riku the thief it put in a position where they had just killed their mom Right, they just took out someone that they never really knew much about, but nonetheless, it's your birth mother, and it still goes to ask the question: Why is it she's going to die? Like, what happened to her? It's probably the birth, right? Gave birth, and it was going to take her life, and Lord Shishomaru put her in the tree to preserve her and keep her alive, regardless of if she can, uh, you know, talk, do anything. She, at least she was alive. Which is kind of dark. Which is it's really dark. Um, but regardless, he's doing it for all the right reasons. Uh, the selfish ones, I guess. Maybe she wanted to pass on and you know, be reincarnated if that's a thing. Who who knows? Like, but he took that away from her for quite some time now. I don't think she'll know the difference until unless someone tells her. I mean, seemingly the tree has had responses or like it's corresponded with certain people so she might have some way of seeing what's going on out there regardless i am really really looking forward to the next episode i can't believe the previews and what they showed i'm not going to get into it because it's heavily spoiled and some people don't even watch the previews for reasons i don't watch the opening credits for reasons some people don't watch the previews and i'm not gonna um, go into detail so yeah, it's getting ridiculously hype, and of course, I think a lot of people are going to come around and say either the show was meh, or it was a better than they expected, or that they just didn't like it in general. That's just how it be. I don't think it's one of these shows that are going to be, oh my god, everybody knows it's amazing, and it's a piece of art, and it's this and that, right? It's not going to be something along those criteria, but nonetheless... I think they did an amazing job, and I'm really curious to see what's going to happen. Knowing that Lord Shishomaru can't bring, bring people back from life anymore, Zero is the last person he's probably going to resurrect, unless somehow the sword gets fixed somehow, but it's crazy to think his weapon is gone, and I think that was the same weapon he used to help destroy uh, the asteroid to save everybody, So, or that he's supposed to use, right? Like, how are they going to, what power does he have? Outside of that, seeing how him and Inuyasha did something, I believe, last time. So, with all that being said, everybody, have an awesome day, night, evening, whatever the case may be. I'm your boy, the Anime G. My phone's dying. 
So I had to go at this weird angle, but I hope you guys enjoy and take care. Peace.